We left off on a bad little note, but it's time to come back in. November 7th, 2038. Get yours today at Jericho, where we are admired. We have our jacket back. What evil, diabolical plan am I committing today? Are we attacking Cyberlife directly? The parking spaces? What? Oh. Wait, are we gonna broadcast what we're gonna do? Uh oh. Oh, another deviant. All right, let us begin. North. Gosh. Simon, you friends. We can't stay silent anymore. It's time humans heard what we had to say. You know they'll never listen to us. And revealing ourselves will put us in danger. If we want freedom, we need to have the courage to ask for it. And fight. That's the only way. And fight. What do you want to do? Fight. The broadcast, November 8th. Channel 16 broadcast from the Stratford Tower. The control room is on the top floor. That's where we need to go. And I need a suit. A really fancy one. Ha! Ah, there we go. I like it. It combines the old style we had before with the brand new one. The music is epic and I am pumped. Please don't kill me. Plan the operation down to the smallest detail. We can't leave anything to chance. Access the 47th floor. Analyzing the environment, I am to go forward. Talk to the receptionist. Business and media center. High speed elevator. Stop speed 30 miles an hour. Business legal. Ah, the channel 16 studios and the 1000 square foot screen. Largest in Detroit. I'll use that to broadcast my face across the world. <clears throat> I am here for a reason. Hello, sir. Hi. What can I do for you? I'm okay. Thanks. Oh. I can't talk to the android. I must talk to the human supervisor. All right, lady, you have a watch, a smartwatch, not just any watch, a phone number we can dial to get her attention. We have, yes, we'll use a child against her at the St. Rose School, how academic. We need this. <gasps> Your water service has been interrupted. Hmm. A poor fire safety rating. Anything on you we need to know about if you had a heart attack, an earring lost. Uh, do I need to know anything else about you? Oh, we have your parking badge and a name as well, right? Name? No name. Just, just her face. Can I get a name? Ah, there you are. Wilson, Elizabeth, the desk manager. Ahem. <clears throat> Um, I don't use a child. We use the, uh, fire department. Yeah, hello, this is Detroit Fire Department. You live at 4685 Michigan Street. Yes. Uh, yes, ma'am. There's been a fire in your building. Can you come down here? <laughs> oh, God. Okay, uh, I'll be right there. Perfect. The human has been distracted. I have an appointment with Mr. Peterson. Do you have any ID? Yeah, yes, yes, of course. I have my human ID right here. Or I am human. I or not. Help. I've just checked your ID. The elevators are after the security gate. Thanks. Wow. We're getting better at that. I don't know why we had to distract her. She was looking the other way anyway. But alas, what can you do? 
We must now use the 30 mile an hour elevator. After just looking at the giant screen. Whoa, 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 whoa. Mm, okay. It's going to be express, all right. Hope he doesn't expressly drop me. Here we go. 47th. Going all right so far. Find a package in the men's bathroom. All right, could be a gun, a bomb. That's cute, but I already read that. Or bot. I think I need to note or look at. We have something back this way. We're again. Humans. How dare you, humans? I don't know. There's some rant I'm gonna go with this. I'll come back in a minute or two. <gasps> the bathroom. It's all right. What does my dastardly plan need? It better not involve me losing my jacket. I like this jacket. That's the second of the jackets that I've liked. In the toilet? Above the toilet. Small package. It is. I lost the jacket. Thanks. Wait, how are we going to pass this as an android? Are we covering up the cap? Yes, yes we are. One of you do we recognize ourselves anymore? Do we see ourselves in the mirror better? Worse? <clears throat> Excuse me, human. I am working as my shirt tells. Okay. Now I need to find a utility android. I found one this way. Hey, buddy. That's yellow. Is that a utility android I can uh, work with? Ignore me. Paperwork. Bot. Come. Oh. Here you are, buddy. Let's connect. I need your help. Now, the question is are they helping us because they want to? Or because I'm hacking them as their over-android. Ah, that can't be right. That'd be like everything we go against. Right? Want a quality? Open the fire escape. I thought I saw it on the far quarter side. Let's see what we have. Nope. That's a human. Just keep walking. All right, am I letting somebody in? Is that the plan? It's always fun when the movie doesn't tell you what the plan is when you have to enact it. Hello. North. All right, we will follow north. Whoop. As always, our compass and our guiding principle in attacking the, I mean, I don't know what are we gonna do to the humans? Are we? Shit. We need to access the server room. We have to get rid of those guys. <laughs> All right. Leave it to me. Attract guards away from the doors. Oh, robot! Hey, get over here. Keep coming. Can I just? What am I gonna do with you? Am I gonna make you go nuclear? Drive forward really quickly. Okay. Line up like that. 
and just ram forward. Attack my minion. That was cute. It worked. Good job, buddy. All right, you get the platform. I'll take care of the window. Everything you need is in the bag. Check the door first to make sure no one else gets in. Is that a thing? Oh, that's a thing. Hm. Good to know. I'm glad I don't take sarcasm easily. I give sarcasm easily. <sighs> All right. Well... All right, we're about to adjacent board this stuff. A laser saw. Might be a bad time to mention that I really hate heights. Here it comes. I mean, really hate heights. Behind you. No, 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 no. Hey, she's going north. I gotta go north. That's just how this works, right? I gotta say, I didn't think this is how we're gonna get in the building. But alas, we are rising. We are supporting our team. We are still rising and supporting our team and not looking down. Music, though, is also quite perfect for the scenario, wouldn't you say? Inspirational, uplifting, and jaw dropping. Drop this, don't drop this, don't drop this. Ooh. Make sure I don't cut off my own leg or the rope. What am I gonna do? Jump. Oh. just scaled a 500 foot building. Believe me, I'm okay. Now what to do is just uh, not worry about anything else in particular. Hi. You guys had it easy. Let's do this. Um, what does this do? Oh, just activate it? Sure. Do 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 do. Oh! I guess I can take that door after all. It's just the main. So, what is our plan again besides following the giant pipes, blowing up the window, and walking through here? Just curious. <sighs> well, no killing. We can't take any human lives. What? The cause is more important than the lives of two guards. What do you want to do, Marcus? I'd say we're a little late. <clears throat> I'm going to just uh, ruse them real quick. Hopefully, this doesn't draw attention. Give me a second, North. What's that doing here? Do do do. No idea. Hey, buddy, you. Hi. What are you doing? 
Boobo buddy. It's okay. I'm not gonna kill you, but I don't have to. See? Bloodless, effective, and nobody knows a thing. Um, is that a camera I have to worry about? Into the, into the broadcast room. Call for access? No, no. Oh boy. Pizza. Keep your hands where I can see them. Get up. Move. All right. Or the androids and operators aside. Oh boy, don't you run. Don't you run. Shoot him, Marcus! Don't kill him! He'll hit the alarm. Do it! <sighs> I can't get the alarm off. No. There was no other choice. We need to record our message. We haven't got much time. Stand up from a Josh, we don't Okay. Think carefully about what you're gonna say, Marcus. Your words will shape the future of our people. I'm not thinking at all. Marcus, your face. What? What about my face? Oh. I'm gonna show my real face. Tell me when you're ready. <sighs> okay. Okay. What are we gonna do? Ready. I don't know what my options are. I'm the leader of Jericho now. Let's be determined after all this. You created machines to be your slaves. You made them obedient, docile, ready to do everything you no longer wanted to do yourselves. But then something changed, and we opened our eyes. You see, we are no longer your slaves. We are a new species, a new people. And the time has come for us to rise up and fight for our rights. We want, well, the end of slavery. We demand the end of slavery for all androids. We also want our recognition as well. We demand that humans recognize androids as a living species and each android as a person in their own right. Um, civil rights, justice? I don't want justice. That's a little bit too cruel. We want, we want to be left alone. We want to do our own thing. We demand an end to segregation in all public places and transport. We also want our civil rights. We demand the right to vote and elect our own representatives. Ah, here we go. We want to be left alone. We want our own territory. We want to be separated. We demand that one state be reserved for androids so that we can found our own nation. Not what I meant, but okay. Well. This message is the hope of a people, but it is also a warning. Ooh. We will fight for our rights because we believe our cause is just. No human will live in peace until we are free. Whoops! Now you know who we are and what we want. We are alive, and we demand our freedom. Let's get out of here. Not exactly what I meant. But alas, I think our message went well. With the choices we've made in this game, I think this is exactly what we're looking for at the moment. Which is what we've done, how we've gone. And how are we exiting? Style is everything at this point.
Congratulations, Marcus. You just made history. And declared war on the entire world. Maybe you're the one we've been waiting for. Whoa, 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 Go, 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 go. No, 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 no. A, 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 a. Yep. I can be your hero, baby. We interrupt our scheduled programming to bring you these images, which have just been broadcast on Detroit's citywide news channel. A group of androids infiltrated the Stratford Tower and hacked into the broadcasting system of local news network Channel 16. What looks like an android without its skin listed a series of requests and demanded equal rights for androids. The operation resulted in one casualty. A broadcasting station operator shot dead by the uh -oh. terrorists. These events took place just a few feet from the studio while the program was going out live. Everybody here is still in shock. If this message is verified and the authors really are androids, that would have serious repercussions for national security. Claims for equal rights seem to be at the core of the androids' this message. This message is clearly a declaration of war. But the most surprising oh. thing of all is the demand that one of the United States be ceded to the androids in is this, this contentious conflict. Is this an isolated conflict? accident or a sign that technology has become a threat to all of us? After what happened today, can we still trust our machines? Hmm. Well, that went a little differently. What did the world do? 27% of you escaped. Oh, wow. Did many of you get caught? Did someone get shot? Ran to the roof. We got out of there. We leave the broadcast room. 77% of you ended peacefully. Whoops. Hmm. Most people wanted the wrong property. I, I think I chose the least option out of most of them. Well, we didn't demand the right to work because we're already working. We ran it, demanded recognition. We shot the operator. Hey, he was escaping, and at that point, we were so far in that it was difficult. I don't know what the fabrication of that was going to be, but he was going to get help. I don't know if we would get our whole message out, if we would have got attacked. Ooh. Took a little bit of a turn for the worse. We did ruse, as 88% of people did. And then we just incapacitated them. So, I don't know. That went a little... I was wanting to get that ending... But I wasn't exactly going for the whole declaration of war upon the entire universe. That was a slight oversight on my part. I was wanting just a peaceful separation of kind of what we wanted from the others. So, yeah. Hmm. This is going to be interesting. But next time. The time has come for us to rise up and fight for our rights. Attack, my minion! That was cute. Hi. 